In today's video, I want to talk to you about how I store my thread and rulers in my quilt studio. Hi, I'm Kim Jamison Hurst of Chatterbox Quilts, and I love to use IKEA Alex units in my studio for specific purposes. Now, there are different types of IKEA Alex units. So you can get ones that are really tall and narrow, not very wide. You can get ones that are shorter and the same width. You can get ones that are shorter and wider <laughs> And let me think, there's one more. So most of these have drawers in them, but there's one that's sort of like a filing cabinet. There's a couple of drawers and a filing cabinet at the bottom. So how do I use these in my studio? Well, I have a long arm and I have a lot of Alex units underneath my long arm. So I like to use the short, narrow ones, the ones that aren't too wide, to store my thread spools in there. Okay, because I have thread spools and thread cones in my studio. So the thread spools fit very nicely in that narrow, short Alex unit. But as I said, I also have cones. So my big cones that I have, I store also in an Alex unit, but that's in the low wide one. And again, that's under my long arm. So it's very handy because that's where I use most of those types of threads. Now, I recently also bought another type of Alex unit. I was mentioning that file cabinet one, and that's what I bought to store my ruler templates. And I'm talking about rulers that I use for ruler quilting, not rulers for measuring. So I have those in a vertical storage. And if you're wondering about how I did that, how I store those exactly, check above or in the description below because I have a video that shows all that. Now, I do like to have IKEA Alex units in my studio, but I also have other IKEA products I use in my studio too. So check above or in the description below to see what other types of IKEA products I use in my quilt studio. Now today I've talked about thread and ruler storage. I've also mentioned that I have other products I use, but you might also be wondering what other types of furniture products I use from IKEA. Well, don't worry, I've got you covered. Check out this video to find out the type of IKEA furniture units I use in my studio and how I use them. For more helpful quilting information, be sure to go to my website at www.chatterboxquilts.com.